Hey Tech Army, what's up? Welcome back to another amazing episode of Tech Timing. So guys, in this amazing episode, we are going to discuss all RTX 4090 AIB cards compared, differences, prices, and more. Are you guys excited? So let's get started. So keep up with me till the end, comment right below this video, subscribe if you still haven't, and turn on the post notification for more videos. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4090 is currently available for purchase. This high-end card is the first launch in the new Ada Lovelace-based RTX 40 series lineup. Several AIB partners have RTX 4090 models that have hit shelves recently. Thus, users who are looking to buy a shiny new BF GPU, big ferocious GPU, will have several options from multiple video card manufacturers. Choosing the best among these can be a bit intimidating especially for first-time PC builders and users who do not have the necessary technical knowledge. Although the choice depends on which model users prefer personally, there are a few other metrics that can help people choose a better performing GPU. A guide to choosing the best RTX 4090 AIB card for a PC build. With the RTX 40 series, 10 major video card manufacturers have prepared 4090 designs, apart from NVIDIA themselves. Major graphics card manufacturer and one of NVIDIA's oldest partners, EVGA, quit the GPU market recently, leaving behind a legacy of high-quality partner designs. 1. The NVIDIA Founders Edition The NVIDIA Founders Edition designs have received a solid quality bump, making them a great choice for most users. The company has created a solid graphics card based on the AD100 and 2 GPU that looks competitive, packs solid thermal performance, and is amongst the cheapest alternatives on the market. The Founders Edition variant is priced at $1,599. 2. Asus Asus is one of the leading hardware manufacturers globally. They also make some high-end cards under their ROG Strix lineup. For the newly launched BF GPU, the Taiwanese hardware manufacturer has come up with a giant boxy design, which is one of the best performing foreign entities money can buy. The high-end Oro G-Strix variant is priced at $1,999. Asus sells the TUF Gaming model on a budget. The 4090 TUF Gaming variant is not a massive step down from the Oro G-Strix model. However, users will miss out on some features, like the over-the-top RGB. It is $400 cheaper at $1,599. 3. MSI MSI, alongside Asus and Gigabyte, is among the leading graphics card brands in the market. For the RTX 40 series, the company is continuing its three lineups, the Ventus cards on a budget, the Gaming X cards in mid-range, and the Supermax cards at the flagship level. The air-cooled Supermax is one of the best options to choose from at the moment. It has been priced at $1,700, only $100 more than Nvidia's baseline. The Supermax cards also have a water-cooled variant this time around. These cards are one of the most expensive and best-performing options available on the market. This GPU has been priced at $1,750. The mid-tier Gaming X cards are significantly cut-down versions of the Supermax models. They can be purchased for $1,599. 4. Gigabyte Gigabyte has introduced two 4090 variants to choose from. Their top-of-the-line model is called the Aorus Master. In the mid-range segment, the company has prepped the gaming OC model, which packs competitive performance at modest pricing. Although the Aorus Master is priced at a hefty premium of $1,799, the gaming OC model can be purchased for $1,699. Overall, the Aorus Master and gaming OC graphics cards come with numerous fancy features that make them a worthy option over others in the market. 5. Inno3D Inno3D has introduced a couple of graphics cards for this generation. The list includes three GPUs in the Icho lineup. Icho X3 card has been priced at a hefty premium of $1,999. For those on a budget, the company has introduced a 4090 X3 OC model. This graphics card is a bare-bones RTX 4090, with just the essentials required to utilize 100% of the card. It has been priced at $1,599. Inno3D is known for producing high-quality graphics cards at a competitive price. The company has also introduced both air-cooled and water-cooled variants of the 4090. 6. Colorful 
Colorful has launched three graphics card lineups with their new 40 series TPUs. These include the water-cooled Neptune OC, the flagship air-cooled Vulcan lineup, and the budget Battle Axe GPUs. The colorful Vulcan GPUs are known for their out-of-the-box design and competitive thermal performance. The flagship entry has been priced at $1,770. For those on a budget, the Battle Axe GPUs offer unmatched performance without costing a fortune. Although they come with a chunky cooler, the Battle Axe GPU is only slightly worse than the FE card in terms of thermal performance. They have been priced at $1,599. So guys, this was all about today's video. Share as much as you can, that really motivates us to create more content for you guys. With this, we end our video. Hope you liked the video.